clear up the wall. We need to go in the Apple store so I can buy myself a new iPhone since my old one's broken. Awesome. I can get the new 128GB iPod Touch. No time. I am not buying you the iPod Touch. Cause you are still grounded. And there is nothing wrong with your 16GB what I got you back in 2008. Yes. There is. I ran out of room to add new music to it. Plus it doesn't even update to the recent iOS and most of the app games won't even work on it. Too bad. You shouldn't need that much music on your iPod. Plus I don't care if it's up to date the new iOS. If you say one more word about it, you're bound it even longer. Now let's get inside before the new iPhone is out of stock. This place doesn't even look like an Apple store. But, the sign said that this is it. You stay here while I go get the iPhone. Don't do anything stupid. Man, this sucks. Daddy won't buy me the new iPod Touch. I wish there was a way for me to have it. Wait. I can just steal it before Daddy comes back. First I must become invisible with the invisibility cloak I stole from Hogwarts. Ha 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 ha. Yes. My plan was a success. Now to download my music from my secret laptop that I keep under the mattress that is still connected to the internet. Awesome. All my music is on the new iPod. And I still have lots of room left for more. Hello. This is Boris Anderson. How may I help you? Boris. One of the iPod touches is missing and hasn't been sold to. You and your son were one of the last customers. What? I didn't take it. I paid for my new iPhone. My son was the one bitching for the iPod. Wait a minute. My son must have somehow stole it when I told him to wait for me. He is in so much trouble. I will return the iPod as soon as possible. Thank you, boys. Once you return it to us, we will give you a free iTunes gift card. Alright. Thanks. I will return the iPod once I deal with that spoiled brat. Bye, Kyle. Get your bold ass downstairs right now. What is it, Dad? I just got a phone call from Apple, saying that one of their iPods are missing and that it didn't get sold. If you stole that iPod, you are in deep trouble. I don't know what you are talking about. Oh yes, I do. I know it had to be you. You said you wanted a new iPod. I am turning your room upside down to find it. Aha! Just as he thought, that little ship did steal the iPod, and he also had a secret laptop too. He is in so much trouble. Plan if I go and steal the iPod touch and have a secret laptop. You know you have forgot to use the internet. That is it. You are going to grind and grind it for an extra 10 months. Today is punishment day. First punishment. Taking back the iPod touch and banning you from the Apple Store. No 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 Next punishment. Destroying your secret laptop. Third punishment. You can only eat the foods you hate. Fourth punishment. Eat the destroying laptop. My mouth is on fire. Either two, or else I will put more fire on you. Now go in your trash to run. It better be clean when I check on you. Hello. You are probably wondering who I am. It's me Mewtwo Fangirl. I like to say that Gonomet and my normal vids will be in kind of a pattern. I have some bad news about Gonomet for schools. They are going to remove the older themes like they did in the normal site. Why? I don't know. If Alvin Hung is poor then he should just get another job and his family should help out. Not just sit around doing nothing. Since Future Animate is most likely not really going to come out. I guess I have to stick with this site and use the business theme. I hate the business theme with a passion. Anyways, I do find it fun to use this site. I just wish Alvin listened to his users.
This is Mewtwo Fangirl signing off.